sterile gloving. Three things we need to do first is to make sure that our table height is at waist position. We need to make sure that we've washed our hands and we need to make sure that the tabletop or the bedside table or the surface that we're using has been cleaned and dried before we set up our sterile field which will be our sterile gloves. So when I take my sterile glove package and I open it up, my sterile gloves inside, the outside will be clean and when I open it is when I'm going to make my sterile field. So I'm going to come in from the sides and you'll see that there's a left and a right. Some gloves actually have pictures of hands like this on the covers. So whichever glove company you have, it doesn't matter. But you come in from the side and this is the little pull tab and you pull this open. When you open this up, you'll want to make sure that you don't let go of the sides and you walk your fingers up and down the side to make sure that you can get it to stay open so it doesn't fold itself back onto your gloves. Now I usually glove my left hand first, but you can glove either one, it doesn't matter. The first glove that you, gla that you grab though needs to the clean to clean surface. So I'm going to grab the cuff like this, make sure I have it in my hands. I'm going to come up and away so I don't drag it across the sterile field. And I'm going to tuck my thumb in like this so I can get my glove on. And you pull down just using the cuff. And then I can reposition it once to get the cuff down where I want it to go. For the second glove, I come in from the top and I need to do sterile to sterile. So I need to get all four of my fingers in and my thumb can help and I lift it up and away again. When I'm ready to get it onto my clean hand, I need to make sure that my thumb is at 90 degrees away so that it doesn't contaminate and I use the cuff to pull the glove down along my other hand and down and around and then when I'm ready, I'll let go and come away and now that's how I put my sterile gloves on. If I had to, I could reposition anything on my fingers and I can touch anywhere on the palmer surface of my hand like this. Otherwise, I now I'm ready to do my sterile procedure and my gloves need to stay at my waist height or higher. And that's sterile gloving.